Hey everyone, let's play some games. Today, I'm playing the Warrior and the Arena. I'm at 7 wins and 2 losses, so let's see if we can get closer to 12 without losing a game. We start out with a mage. Right, right. We are at 7 plus wins, which means we will face a lot of mages with a lot of fireballs. Let's keep the 5 e works, even though I have so many. So it's kind of dangerous, I might end up with 4 in my hand. Thankfully that was not the case, but not too much better. Cool Taskmaster could be useful early on, but only if she plays something with 1 health. Not quite. Well, I don't think there's any reason to use the coin here. I can, you know, play maybe a 5 rewards. Hmm. Now I'm actually tempted to play the Cruel Taskmaster. Because that trades with that and that without taking any damage. And it would actually survive unless she also fire blasts. And I would love for her to. Yes, I think this is a good play. Next turn I can even coin out a Corcoran Elite if I want. Oh, Cobalt Geomancer. You're so bad in this deck. At least I have one the one spell in my deck in my hand. I can combo it for massive value. So I can either coin out the Corcoran or I can play the 5 e wax And I think the 5 e wax is clearly superior. We'll get the Geomancer out there with some board presence, and I still have a good turn to uh, play next turn. The light protects me. Hmm, that's not really what I wanted to see. I can, like, sure, I can hit it with the axe, but that's a sh oh, well, that's pretty good. It's just too bad I don't have anything else to play with it, which makes it less good. So it's like if I run that into that, it'll be like a 4-2. Play that, it'll be a 2-2. Two, two. But yeah, this is the better tempo play, let's do that. I don't really need to armor up right now. Plus, I might want to call Taskmaster for the Guru Bashi. Let's get rid of that. Attack the face. Yeah, well, that'll be a nice play for next turn. And then on turn 6, call Taskmaster plus possibly Modal Strike. Hmm. Well, now playing the Cool Taskmaster is awfully tempting, so I can kill that. I think that's worth it. So, but I also want to use the Taskmaster with the Acolyte, but can't have it all. I think this is the best play. And I do have another Taskmaster in the deck to possibly combo with the Acolyte. Now I wish I had the Geomancer out for a 5 damage mortal strike. Hmm. Well, I need to kill that. How do I want to do it? I think I want to do it this way. I mean, I could do the mortal strike, but then I have no 2 drops. I think this is clearly superior. Are gonna flame strike me? It's not the best flame strike in the world. Still annoying. Blizzard? Cone of cold, okay. Hmm. Well, she used a lot of cards. I actually have a clear card advantage. Let's. How do I wanna deal with it? 
I think. Uh, yeah, I really want to just clear the board here. So let's play this. And I'm up. Doing pretty good. I think I'm ahead here. Clearly ahead on cards. Life is equal. I have a slight board advantage. Hmm. I wonder what that secret could be. Could be mirror entity. That's a fairly popular pick in arena. I think Normus Inventor would not be a very strong minion to copy because she wouldn't draw the cards. So let's play this first and see what we get. Alright, so it wasn't Mirror Entity. Could be Vaporize. I think a 1 1 Imp for the Vaporize could be pretty good. But I mean, she'll probably kill it with Fire Plus. But even then, I'll have like a 1 4 I can run into her. But if she doesn't Fire Blast. Let's do this. Let's just get rid of that. In case I get another weapon that I want to play next turn. Which is actually pretty likely. I have how many fiery boxes? I think I've only had one so far this game. It means I have three more in the deck. Another secret. Alright, how do I approach this? We can still have the mirror entity, so I should get a weak minion out. If I play this, can I kill it? Well, I guess I could Mortal Strike it. Then I would trade a Mortal Strike for a mirror entity. And that's fine, because I'm ahead on cards. Let's try that. Alright, let, let's check if it's uh, Vaporize. It's not Vaporize. Hey, oh, it's Counterspell. <laughs> that actually makes a lot of sense. Huh. Alright, hey, I think this is good. I need to get rid of that Demolisher. Oh, that's a good end. Hmm. Still think I'm quite a bit ahead, unless she has some really good cards there. Flame Strike plus Arcane Intellect. That would be really good. Oh. Less good. Hmm. Alright, actually that's not that bad. That's actually pretty good for her. I really wish I had a weapon here. I have so many weapons in the deck, but now I can't draw them. Well, I absolutely need to get rid of Leroy. And I think I want some armor. What if I play... Guru Bashi. I hope it gets hit by the Demolisher. The Armor Smith and the Scarlet Crusader. And get rid of Leroy. Do you want to attack here? No, not really. Alright. Can I even get an extra armor there? Mm, unfortunate. Now she can just kill it with the fire blast. Fire blast is definitely a superior hero power to armor up when it comes to late game in arena. Because she can still do things, even though she's low on cards. Come on, hit the Gubashi. 
Oh, I have weapon. Excellent. Oh wait, it's the start of the turn what I'm talking about. Um, let's see here. I need to kill... Let's do that. Weapon. Then get the tiger out. Like that. Yep, that seems very good. Alright. Let's see what we get next. Keep the dream alive. Only four more games for 12 wins. Mages. Mages and Paladins. That's what I predict we will see a lot of here. And we have a Paladin. Yep. Not too surprising. Okay, I'll keep the 5 war axe. Tempted to keep the Corcoran because I might want to coin it out on turn 3 and it's just such a strong card. Let's keep it. I'm going second. I have lots of cards. Decent variety. I'm great at killing the hero power minions. Yeah, this could work out. Like he passed, then turn 2 hero power, then I play that. Then turn 3, I'll have the Corcoran. See you pass. And if you don't pass, I have something ready for you. Unless it's a secret. Well, turn one can't be that complicated. Come on now. Okay, uh, let's see. No point in coining anything out. Oh, this could be a long one. At least he's not like that the Warlock I played the other day and constructed. Like every turn, like he would play his uh, moves really fast, and he was a good player. But then after he played what he wanted to play, he would just wait for the rogue to burn down, never clicking in turn. It was quite annoying. So it ended up being like a game. I think it went to eight mana or something, but it lasted 19 minutes, and I lost. <laughs> to make matters even worse. Sword of Justice. Hmm. Wish I had an ooze. Alright, I could coin out a Yeti. That actually seems pretty solid. The next turn I can play Corp Run. Alright. Or if I want to use a weapon, I can weapon a Geomancer. The light protects me. Oh, that's so good together with the Sword of Justice. Yeah, that's what it's called. Hmm. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. I wish I had a consecration. Alright, so how do I deal with this? I think I need the weapon. 
and I need the Geomancer. Kill that. That. Ah, then you can just kill that, only losing the shield. But I mean, I can't just armor um, up, I will just lose board control and... You know, I just have to suck it up. Play some minions. Take it like a man. What do you got? Acid Drake. Another very strong minion. Oh, I wish I had six mana now. That would be so good. What can I do with five mana here? I think I might just mortal strike and then kill that with the weapon. I'd rather use a mortal strike on it than a cork run. Yeah. Let's do that. Your mensa continues to be useless. He buffed it to 5, but I only needed 4. I hope you like my invention. Okay, well at least that's a bad card in Paladin, so... He doesn't have all good cards. Uh, let's see... That doesn't make a lot of sense with that on the board. This is decent. It's just such a shame that I don't have a 2-drop to play with it. Like, if I had 7 mana, it would be great. But if I play this now, it just dies to the weapon and... Well, that's it. Which kinda makes me think that maybe I would rather play a Senyan, because I value this minion higher. For the immediate impact it can make. Could also play Demolisher plus Scarlet Crusader. He can kill that with the weapon. He can take the shield off with the 1-1. One, one. But it would leave a free one on the board. But then next turn, I'll have 7 mana. And it's a little awkward again. But if I play this, I can play the Corcoran Elite and the free drop next turn. Let's do it that way. Not great, but hopefully it'll work. Ah, Blessing of Kings. Nasty. I really need a 5 Evo Axe or something. Imp Master. Hmm. Nothing really great to play here. I mean, oh yeah, it's just I can take that out, but then he can easily just kill it with the Lepanome. Do this, kill the Lepanome. I can play an Imp Master maybe. Just because that'll be a lot of targets to deal with. Yeah, let's just do it this way. Hmm. Not happy with this. Not at all. He can kill that with that. He can kill that with that. Kill the 1-1 one, one with... The... Oh no, a cult master. So much value. Well, the Argent Commander is going into the Cold Master, that's for sure. I really need a 5e works here. That's not what I needed. Nope, this could be the end. Ok, 
kill that with that. Then this is free to hit the face. Again, the weapons are not really showing up when I need them. It's either like I get three weapons at once, or I don't get them. That's not entirely fair though, I did have one fire more axe earlier. Alright, so... It's looking pretty bad, but let's do what we can. At least this should let me survive one more turn, but I'm behind on cards, behind on life. Kind of tempo. It's ugly. <laughs> I need a flame strike. That's what I need. All right. Well, I think this run is over. Let's see what we get as rewards. Opening here. I'll take eight wins. That's pretty good. Yay, a wrath. But 180 gold, that's good. And then let's see uh, what we get in the pack. Maybe some legendaries. Not quite, but we did get two rares. Alright, thanks for watching everyone. I'll see you next time. Bye bye!